Namme yoho venge kyo. Namme yoho venge kyo. Namme yoho venge kyo. Give thanks and praise to the mystic law of the universe and its protective forces in nature that guide our thoughts and our path in all ways that are positive, correct, and lawful. Give thanks and praise. Greetings, greetings, greetings. Yeah, let us continue with the Jamaica Constitution. And we are going to proceed from number 15 where it said, No person shall be deprived of his personal liberty, save as may in any of the following cases be authorized by law. You have A. In consequences of his unfitness to plead to a criminal charges or b in execution of the sentence or order of a court whether in Jamaica or elsewhere in respect of a criminal offense of which he has been convicted or c in execution of an order of the Supreme Court or of the Court of Appeal or such as a court as may be prescribed by Parliament on the ground of his contempt of any such court or of any other court or tribunal. And it go on D, E, F, G, H and so forth. So, in order for you be deprived of any personal liberty, for one you have in a contract with these people, once you have no kind of contract, then none of these things apply. However, because you're an inhabitant of this place and you're already on this place, these things apply to the people um, that is in contract, that is in contract, that is not aware of they, that they are in what I'm call a private agreement or a silent agreement through this adhesive contract. We go down to number two where it starts to explain any person who is arrested or detained shall be informed as soon as reasonable, practicable, in a language which he understands of the reasons for his arrest or detention. Any per number three, any person who is arrested or detained, A, for the purpose of bringing him before a court in execution of the order of a court, B, upon reasonable suspicion of is having committed or being about to commit a criminal offense and who is not released shall be brought without delay before a court and if any person arrested or detained upon reasonable suspicion of his having committed or being about to commit a criminal offense is not tried without a reasonable time then Without prejudice to any further proceeding which may be brought against him, he shall be released either unconditionally or upon reasonable question authorities, the taking during a period of public emergency of measures that are reasonable, justifiable for purposes of dealing with the situation that exists during that period of public emergency. Let me go back over this part again. I'm kind of like how this a breakdown. And if any person arrested, let me highlight this place right here. And if any person arrested or detained upon reasonable suspicion of having committed or been about to commit a criminal offense is not tried within a reasonable time, then, without prejudice to any further proceeding which may be brought against him, he shall be released either unconditionally or upon reasonable question authorities the taking during a period of public emergency of measures that are reasonable, reasonably justifiable for the purpose of dealing with the situation that exists during that period of public emergency. Brethren, these guys don't have any right for the stop you. Yeah and do whatever them feel arbitrarily. You have to have authority, 
some delegated authority for you public safety officers to act you have to have some form of authority it can't be because you have a gun or you probably not like how a man look you just jump and act and feel like say boy you're justified because you have the government of jamaica behind you you can't do that these things when I read now, them thing you write in a stone, brethren. Them thing you law, cause it as say, even on a public emergency. Even on a public emergency. We now if you have justifiable reason for, for, for deal with anything we we'll not try to deal with. So you can't just call public emergency and tear down some people house and when you look, the people them not have nothing bad in them house, the people them don't even have nothing in them house. You get me? Them bed up on four concrete block. You get me? Them table up on about three, three, three foot Because one have to catch up in the corner so it not drop down The man them have to know how to do as public official You can't be not dunce You can't be not dumbo If you do not know law Then you vacate your authority The moment you do not know law Or a man is in front of you Who demonstrate law And a demonstrates a boy Him have more information or knowledge than you the simple fact when i have that knowledge you vacate your authority you have to stand down get a notebook and a pencil so you can learn this is how we can grow this is the only way we can improve it's not about oh him sound so make we kill him make we destroy him make we mash him up him know too much you crazy that now gonna change nothing now gonna change nothing we we'll move on to number six. If any person who is lawfully detained by virtue only of such a law as is referred to in subsection five of this section, so request at any time during the period of that detention, not earlier than six months after he last made such a request during that period, his case shall be reviewed by a by an independent and impartial tribunal established by law. Hold well on. So if this is where it takes for your case be reviewed by an independent, impartial tribunal established by law. So what kind of what, what was going on before? What was going on before? I continue. And preside over by a person appointed by the Chief Justice of Jamaica from among the persons entitled to practice or to be admitted to practice in Jamaica as a barrister or solicitor. Them they are just fancy name for your attorney. Barrister, solicitor, and entitled to practice, meaning if you have a bar license. These are bar attorneys. Bar association members. Now get to the root of what the bar is. You have to go back to Inns Court. You have to go all the way back to Inns Court. So we're not talking about a little surface garbage. We go to the root. And when you go to Inns Court and do some basic research, you're going to find out where the crown is. You're going to find out what is the crown. You will find out who is the crown. You have to do them research there. I'm just here to shine light on some information. You get me? Now, I can go as far as say that the crown where you guys are talking about thinking it's the queen. In Jamaica, Regina, it's not the queen. It's not her monarchy. The true crown is the Templar Church. And their location is in London City. Yeah, Crown Row. Just go look it up. That is the true crown. When I create my documents, I address to the office of the Templar Church, the crown. To the office of the Governor General, Commonwealth of Jamaica. To the office of the Secretary of State. United States of America. So this is how I address our documents. I don't look at the little instrumentalities like the government of Jamaica, who is only an instrumentality of the United States Corporation. When I really deal with the agencies, we go to them parent corporation, them boss, and the Templar Church is that crown so when you address the templar church then all the archbishop in your area have to take notice because by law when them get that notice they're going to contact Dessa 
And when the Archbishop get that information, they have to come look at you now to see how you go on, what kind of oppression you under. Because remember, you know, the Pope already declared Saboa in, a ni- in, a, in, a 19, in a 2014. The, the Pope declared Saboa. All of these agencies where they say an operator operating in a defector capacity and it is unlawful and illegal. But most people now have this information because it seems like a private information, even though the information can be found right there in the public. It's like a dilemma where, you know, if you're not keen, you don't even know what's going on. You miss it. So what we are trying to say is we have some fundamental rights where we can't separate from these fundamental rights. Only through deception. Usually it's silent deception. You know what I mean? And then lack of knowledge. Usually, usually on our part we lack the knowledge. We spend so much time doing so much different things. Yet we find a problem when it comes down to spend some time for ourselves trying to improve ourselves however I'm not knock a one because most of we not really even know so we can do that most of we not even know we can text talk ourselves you know what I mean most of we not know say it's okay to ask a question from to anyone the moment I'm going to give you any kind of talk or statement it's okay for you to ask, where is your delegation of authority? By what authority are you trying to govern me? And once your authority is lawful and correct, then I know of a problem and uh, 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 respect that authority. You know what I mean? And conform and act accordingly. Because once it's lawful and correct, oh gosh, that is my world. There's no issue. There's absolutely no issue once it's lawful, once it's correct. Now, do not bring your contract laws, your corporate laws, your commercial laws, rules, regulation in the form of a statute, guised as law. Do not bring that to the forefront and say, hey, this is what we, we want you to conform to. You are now compelled by these so-called statutes. That is treason. Don't do that. Do it with the people them we can't read and write. Do it with the people them we are totally unaware. When you do it with a man when I'm sovereign capacity, meaning he's self govern When we say sovereign, you know, it's like we are say we autonomous. We are self govern I don't take on to all of these meaning where everybody I chose to impart or bring to fit them thing. You see true, this is I am at the statement. When I use the word, this is what I mean. I don't allow any outside entity to determine my meaning of my words. This is what I mean when I say sovereign. Sovereign simply means you self-govern. You ask no outside entity for permission to breathe, to be, to think, to act. You don't ask no outside permission. You have no interest or need for a third party. Hence, you're in your sovereign state capacity. It is as simple as that. All those other narratives are just there for kind of turn you away from what you truly are. It's called confusion. That's what Babylon breakdowns to. Babylon breakdowns to confusion. So the moment you start balance your thoughts, you start balance the way you are, you know, look at things, then a lot of these confusion are going to be with fusion. You know what I mean? It's going to be just what it is. Can with fusion. So everything does like a formulate and come together. Once you find that equilibrium, once you find that balance, it's not hard. <laughs> Usually all you have to do is seek and you find. Yeah, man. And when you ask questions, man, you usually will get a lot of information. And in that information, the answer is there. It's just you for looking at the body of information where you have and remove the contradiction from that body of information then you work with where you need for work with yeah man i learned them thing then other you know trivial method of learning because when we are grow them i say yeah wisdom knowledge and understanding now if you look at it that way wisdom how can you get wisdom 
without all the rest. Wisdom is supposed to be the last thing you attain. So we say knowledge, understanding, and then wisdom. Because knowledge, all knowledge is, is data. Knowledge is just information, a body of information. When you look out, all the way you look at, that's where you gather your knowledge. Now, when you gather all of that knowledge and thing and bring them together now, for in order to gain understanding, you have to remove the contradiction from that body of knowledge. You have to remove that thing where them say it doesn't make sense, it doesn't flow, and you remove those things. When you do all of that and remove all of those things, now you have understanding. And the moment you can explain it in multiple ways, and then even act upon it in a practical way. Now that is wisdom. So I just break down knowledge, understanding and wisdom to you guys. In one of its practical ways. Play about the tape. Take your time and go over it. Because I know I talk with this authentic accent. I talk with this awawak, awawak accent. Because we are the true Indian. You get me? And if you break down India and it's like I said, boy, we are the ones that we never have no kind of foreign gods. Because we deal with nature. Whenever we look to the image, it never in us. We are put an image to this thing. This thing was everything. So we now have to say it's this or that. It's everything. So when we say the mystic law, you get what I say? Some man say, yeah. God, them have a name, all kind of names, but throughout the ages, names change. And we go back to the basic where it comes and the man them say, <gasps> It's like the bread, how wa? Some man say, Hey, yeah. Some man say, All different kind of things. Hey, it's not a problem. God, your volition, how I really count. Your intention, how I really count. You know what I mean? But I love the authentic and I work with the ancestral spirit. So I say, Hawa. Oh, Hawa. Hawa. Great spirit. Whose voice I hear in the wind. And whose breath give life to all the earth. Anna can drop. Can you drop the document where you find in our old book many years ago? Then prayer is an old Indian prayer. You get me? And 432 drop. Remember when them you that just come out with them platform. Just a break away from Lex Will. May I watch some people upon the net before them even. Before them think them become famous as they think they are now. Remember some platform when I take a look at them. Them have 18 view. 15 view. When them get all the top view is when it's in the 29 view. Them get all the top view. I remember those things. Some of you guys might totally forget these. Because when I don't look on a subscription now, when I don't views, it has say 100,000. How much, how much, how much K. So I kind of get carried away. And forgot to say I was there. Check my thing. I'm from 2011. My platform there. I'm not just come. I'm even there from before that. You get me? So I see a lot of you guys come and I see a lot of you guys go. And I, most of them don't do nothing at all. They just dip on it the same way I make money off of YouTube. The moment you collect money from YouTube, you are engaged in commerce. That's why the government laugh at you. YouTube laugh at you. Because it is commerce. It's for profit or gain. A YouTuber pay you. Who you think own YouTube? The government already tell you clearly so them own everything. Unless you rebut it. So I don't monetize. And I like me and I need money. I need some resource to get certain things done. But I choose not for bow aya. Sin. And so I just look upon things. I look through things. And I mean, I mean, I have no hang up for money. I have no kind of inclination to be rich. Because I'm truly wealthy. I'm truly wealthy and so are you. On a substitute wealth for riches. When we say wealth, we are talking about hereditament. We are talking about heritage. We are talking about lineage. We are talking about pedigree. We are talking about consanguine. We are talking about bloodline. Are that so what thing there? 
a man like I, although all of we mix up, mix up, the moment they hear them say I, they hear them know some come from one of them pure bloodline there. It's strong. You know, for wonder who and what I am. From your CI, you know, so there is a man, there is a true man in I earth. God, that's all we know as. You know what I mean? This living soul manifests, known as man. So this is who I am. We're not there for coming press people are going like we want to show off on the body. However, we are what we are. We are what we are. We are who we are. You know what I mean? Don't make no man tell us about why you are this or that if you know you are not. You know what I mean? Don't be afraid for correct a guy and say, hold up my brethren. You might come from this place. But you have to speak for yourself. You have to represent your house. I, I not allow a man to represent me after I'm in a clown. A lot of guys try to do that. Some guys meet me and as they meet me, so boy, I find myself in all kind of business women don't even know about. In all kind of dealings women don't know about. A man just attach my name to all kind of things that I have to keep and I correct someone and I tell someone, say, go easy, no man. You know, say, some high thing under that. You know what I mean? If you come to me and need something, try to get what you need. Now don't try, you know, attach me to where you are do. Especially where you are do in, is inferior to where me are do. Because you want money to get rich. While me say, boy, me I reclaim my inheritance, my hereditament. That estate name coming from my father, it's not mine. It's my house name. You get me? It's that estate name. It's coming from my father. That's coming from his father. That's coming from his father. And so on and so on and so on. On, on, on. To the foundation of time. So when we become a part of the commonwealth, our inheritance is locked in that trust. When the must say Jamaica, Jamaica is a corporation. Jamaica is that trust. You know what I mean? So when we say Zamaka, now we are talking about authentication. We are talking about authentic. We are talking about what is truth. We are talking about the original. Yeah, man. When we say we are the Awawak Indian, are we that? When you know you so watch cowboy or Indian show and we are say, hey, when me a little boy and a man now want to be an Indian, every man want to be cowboy. Because the cowboy them always a kill out the Indians. So no man no want to be no Indian. Pity. Pity. If only we knew say we are the Indian with the cowboy. The so called cowboy them a slaughter. We. It's not those long stringy ear people you see on the TV. Remember whoever control the image. Control the view of yourself. It's like Jamaica. When them a show you image of ancient our work in a Jamaica. Them show you some big belly skinny. Stringy short people say them are our work. So where are they now? Show me them grave. Show me any one of them grave that is 500 year old on this landmass. Show me it. You can't show me. Don't to any Chinese will come here, come here as, as indentured servants. Because them couldn't enslave us on this rock. We were one of these people where them said, boy, we have to bring in some things to them. And this is how you see the Indian come here. When you see Indian own a bunch of things, them come here as slaves. There's a document out there that said they were white and they were slaves. Go look up that document. All of these things are out there. I now just make up these things. I just study. You get me? And I just do like some man where I tell themselves so they watch two YouTube videos and I say, Oh, I learned from this man and I learned from that man or I study here and I study there. I don't do those things. You get me? When me study, my lockdown and me study. And you can't know a man when him study. And a man when I study none at all. A man would just like to regurgitate. Forget sound bites. You know what I mean? And if that is where a man like and that is a man thing again, you know me. Free will, do what you want. It's all good. However, I am here for shine light on what is lawful 
and on what is correct. You know what I mean? By our own omission and our own commission, that is how we shall be judged. So the man will want to point the finger, he can, because that same finger will be pointed at you. And make sure when it's a point at on you, you're not found wanting. You have to make sure of that. So brethren, see the Jamaica constitution here. Yeah. And it not play. No property. Watch this. <coughs> Number 17, I say, No person shall be subjected to torture or inhumane or degrading punishment or other treatment. So when you uncuff me on the street side, and you just tell me, you know, I take no talk from me when I say, let me get your supervisor. Can you bring that supervisor out here? You have your little ugly friend called Larry Curly and Moe, you know. Larry had a little tall one, the little corporal. Oh, Larry had a constable. Curly were uncuff me, him had a corporal. So the constable pretend to be the supervisor within their conspiracy. Because they have a law, you know, we say the law named Conspiracy Against Rights. And when you guys look it up, when you guys look it up, Title 18 USC, I think it's 242. But look it up. 241 and 242. Go look it up. You gotta realize what kind of problem you guys in now because again, this time is a new time. You wait for see some bang and starlight and say, yeah, the time changed. The time changed long time ago, man. From 2012, everything shift, man. All those who are of unclean hands better clean up on a act. No phone or go prison. No for no go face financial ruin. Yeah man. The trickery and the deception and you guys devices. Them thing they are come to a naught. The world now any no. We just have, have more correction in other place. That's about it. We now say about the little adversarial energy not going to be around, you know. But it's going to be so minute but we can identify it as it put out its head. So you guys who are, who are of unclean hands, who are profit of, uh, you don't call it now, slavery, of uh, the voluntary slavery because of deception and trick for the people them voluntarily subject themselves to these kind of conditions. So you guys of unclean hands who are profit, you know you guys. A time I go come, we're going to ask for an audit. We're all on a bank and financial statements and all on a little money we want to collect on the side and all on a little nefarious activities going to have to come to the forefront. Yeah, man. This is when we're going to put on over the water. We're going to walk over the water. You know what I mean? So we can see on a nakedness. We're going to expose on a nakedness, man. We now have to come correct. Because time change. Time change. Number 18. Yeah, I'm going to skip number 17 to number 18 1. No property of any description shall be compulsory taken possession of and no interest in or right over property of any description shall be compulsorily acquired except by or under the provisions of a law that a prescribe the principles on which and the manner in which compensation law of compensation now play with a the law there Therefore is to be determined and given and be secures to any person claiming an interest in or right over such property a right of access to a court for the purpose of I establishing such interest or right if any deter to determining the amount of such compensation if any to which he is entitled and tree. Enforcing his right to any such compensation. I know me I get all kind of compensation. Because the phone will tell me so I'm not going to have to compensate me for this inconvenience. And you saw me I break it down simply. 
Yeah, man. And then number two, I said nothing in this section shall be construed, meaning interpret, as affecting the making or operation of any law so far as it provides for the taking of possession or acquisition of property. And you go down to A, B, C, D, E, make a thing. I see one where say G, by way of vesting or administrate or administration of trust property. It's a G. By way of the vesting or administration of trust property. Trust property, one. Enemy property, two. Or the property of the person adjudged or otherwise declared bankrupt or insolvent person or otherwise declared bankrupt or insolvent person of unsound mind deceased person or bodies corporate or unincorporate in the course of being wound up hey you see when you break down all this section g you know it i talk about the bird surfer ticket and, and, and the juristic person that is attached to the bird surfer ticket that is totally unaware of what's going on. This is them constitution. This is them law. You know what I mean? Number three. Nothing in this section shall be interpreted as affecting the making of operation of any law. Number four. Number five. Number six. Nineteen. Except with his own consent, no person shall be subjected to the search of his person or his property or the entry by others on his premises. Look at this, number 19, Jamaica Constitution, chapter 3, deal with fundamental rights. Number 19, this is the violation of these public safety officers Larry Curley and more Curley you're in so much problem brethren cause you a fall person you like for touch man I tell you so you act like you're a sadist a two time you search me you know I come upon an interview at the police station and I have you upon tape and ask me for your search you know when I had a group of police there you know he's a, you must be a sadist my brethren brethren it's easily corrected Easily corrected, brethren. But you have to pay me for consultation, brethren. I'm not going to get the correction, they're free. You can't get the correction, they're free. You have to pay me 500 US dollars for your one hour consultation, curly. Just come sit in, bring your money, come. I'm going to straighten you out. And you're going to live a commendable life after that. Going forward, you're probably going to end up turning the commission of police. Because when you get this information and this correctness, you can balance yourself. However, you're going to have to pay for this action because by your own omission and commission are the only thing I can judge you. So see it here, sir. Jamaica Constitution, Chapter 3, Number 9. 19, Number 1. Except with his own consent. And I remember telling you, sir, watch I do not consent to... Yeah, I'm write a letter to the courthouse letting them know I do not consent to these proceedings. I have... Listen, I keep, me, me keep meticulous records of everything, you know. I send a registered letter to the court when them send me them summons, letting them know I do not accept your offer to contract and I do not consent to these proceedings. However, through threat and duress, I still present myself at that court location because you know so when you not come, you know. All helicopter them man they come for you, you know. Them not go for the scammer them like how oh, them would have come for a man like me, you know, brother. And them not go give me a chance for them to arrest me, you know. Them not go say that little man here, yeah, you know. Him know too much, you know. Yeah, man, all when me is not a problem. Not a problem to no one at all. You get me? So this is why I'm there in the public and demonstrate. And I publish my knowledge. I'm not here to talk about a next man platform. I'm not here to talk about what some people are doing or what I'm not doing. You notice me I talk about myself. Because this is a high platform. And I welcome all ones. I welcome all ones. I don't care why you're persuasion. You could be a Muslim. You could be a Christian. 
You could have been anything where you want to be, you have that right. I always say that and I respect those rights. Just come with the right spirit. You know what I mean? If you have the idiot spirit there, so from you know you enter I land, I Buddha land, I heaven. Check them spirit there at the door, brother. And forward. You get me? Anything where you can get, you just take and give thanks and push forward and go strengthen yourself. Because that's all we're there for. I'm not operating a business. I'm not engaging business for profit or gain on the internet. Later, some people are going to know about me need this and me need that. And then people are going to voluntarily just say, Yo, I send on this and I send on that. And when they do it, they come from a place where they are going to talk about say they look for this or that in return. Some man forget all that thing and because there is no fanfare, you can't get that. But turn on the spotlight on him and, and say, Boy, everybody knows him supposed to do something. You're going to see a man give up some things or a woman. Mm give up some things freely why through the spotlight they on them and them want recognition of the wrong intention that your volition not clean them gift they are not gift some man have to correct themselves ones have to correct them thoughts ones have to correct them deeds all you have to do is just make an effort you get me remember you're perfect you know so when you start make that effort everything will conform to what you are do no man tell you you're not know, perfect. Sin. If a man say you're not know, perfect, that means the creator will make you make a mistake. And now that is sacrilege. You get me? So, I just them energy there. Except with his own consent. That means so when a man talk to you, he must even have consent for talk to you. And the moment I say, listen man, this is me in my private capacity, you are in your corporate capacity, no mix. Stop talk now, you should just cease and spare yourself the financial ruin, because that is the only way we can beat you guys. You know? We're not going to beat you know, with no weapons, physical weapons. You know, our only weapons is spiritual. So that's so now we are going to totally decimate you know, spiritually, because we are come from a place where is true we are come from a place where it's correct we are come from a place where it's lawful you know what i mean we are come from a place where we are totally in conformation with nature and nature's creator and that's our thing there when i depend a little joke a plane with uno there when man a move man move upon the foundation and then we, we, we raise the level they were gone upon the framework. Yeah, man. So when we start trying with upon the foundation of the earth and we move to the framework of the earth. So we kind of say it's construction. And then we just, you know, elevate ourselves to a level where we can step way above the earth now and I look upon what go on within the earth. And these things are things where the eye them can attain easily. Because not like you go here or go there. It's all mental. It's all mental. And if it's mental, you know you can't feel it, touch it, or even see it. So you know that is what is really spiritual. Brethren, I could do this thing, man. And when I said do this thing, I talk about it. I just improve myself. I could start now. We now fear wait till later. Look upon them things where we are showing you, brethren. Them documents are important, man. When we touch down upon number 20, whenever any person is charged with a criminal offense, he shall, unless the charge is withdrawn, be afforded a fair hearing with a reasonable time by an independent and impartial court established by law. That means a youth traffic court where you have conflict of interest, because you are also. You are look money, you are not an impartial tribunal. There is no way in a year things that you are independent when you are a corporation. So you see, right there so you disqualify yourself from me even I try to talk about an authority. No one has though. Ignorance of the law is no excuse. Govern yourself accordingly. 
God, don't feel no way this is a public venue. You think it's just me alone looking at you. Now the spotlight is on you guys. The floodlight is on you guys. The international community I look at you guys. Knowing all along so no improper all we need are somebody for shine the light on you guys. Correct yourself. You live in a big house, you have chauffeur driven police escorts and all these things yes it's a beautiful thing so just correct yourself you're all in an honorable office it's not a joker office your integrity in that office should be so high when you walk on the ground you glide in thin air this is how your integrity should be within those public office police officer I know some boy I don't have a challenge out there you know especially for the one that was sincere now you have a set out there where you don't know to hustle them out there for hustle. Them just want to make a money. So if I kill a man forget get that money there, that's not a problem for them. You get me? If I kill a woman and get that money there, that is not a problem. God, that's for them. All intention is for us to hustle some money. Now you see you guys, at this me have to tell you now. Go easy, because money and I want to think it is. My police brethren, we're, we're quick to get all a little extra money for go do some extra work. Brethren. Yes, it's true. You have a bird surfing ticket. Just start study about it. Or you contact me and I'll show you if you access it and you can look and see what they did. Then now, all that we can study and try, at, at, you know, we just try to reclaim what is ours. Because some foreign entity really have all that we supposed to have as inheritance. It lock up in a freedom trust where them administer it. You get me? That's when them attach the social security number in a Jamaica them call it TRN number which can be tax registration number or it can be treasury registration number it can be anything you want to be because them not specify nothing what them are do is when you start studying the correct sentence structure communication parse syntax grammar through the Russell Gould and the David Wynn Miller, because I have learned it from them a long time there when I just Russell Gould and David Wynn Miller. Now I see a brethren named Mark Christensen or something like that from, from England. And he's a good brother, he have a, some little style to him thing. You get me? But me can tell you say, that post office bureaucracy is a maritime jurisdiction. And the maritime jurisdiction now apply here when we depend on the land. We only adhere to the common law that is documented in stone which states that it is the supreme law of the land those parent document you know what I mean law of the land we don't need to forget the sea law when we depend on the land we totally understand and we totally comprehend we totally understand the concept when you ask about how we are vessel and all of these things but let me tell you something man I predate all of them things that Because when you talk about the post office, Jamaica Check it, Jamaica are the very first British colony We established a post office Jamaica is the very first British colony That established a post office And it's not in 1775 Our thing was established from in about 16 something May have the, may have the specifics right here but they are them for do some research and make we talk about it. So don't tell me about no postal sit down from bureaucracy or government. I'm gonna tell you who are the government. You talk to the government. I in my sovereign capacity. I claim all the Americas. I claim from the Arctic to the Antarctic on this hemisphere. It's all ours. It's mine. When I come with a commonwealth, I was here. I predate your commonwealth documents. I predate your so called 1962 independent doc. I predate all of those things. You guys are doing business on my land. You guys are in my house. D B A doing business as that's what the government of jamaica is doing that's what all these corporations are doing and as such 
they are considered in law as a foreign nation or a foreign state opposed to the sovereign state these things are law brethren may have some document will break these things down easily however as we go forward you know as we go forward <coughs> this document a treatise and falls a treatise and arrest and falls imprisonment so this document right here i'm going to show you a thing that i did from just this document yeah we may have some document for like four five six years you know and it's when me reach a level in my studies that's when i can access i i i become able to access those documents because me always ask to a document but when me read them me lost so me really have to go apply myself so me can access them so our thing is not 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 like you you watch to youtube and talk like you know some things and you don't know nothing at all them thing there is embarrassing but them thing they also are set you up for a hard fall car any day them draw ones and ones in and say time for your test them are gonna fail the test them are gonna fail the test them will fail the test sir. right here here's a letter this thing i move too fast but yeah me have to send a letter to the traffic court judge because i went to court on the 9th of january however i get there late because i remember these people take away my private automobile so i not have no kind of control over my move or convey myself anymore so if i call a bridge and have to wait for the bridge in all two or three hours then i can't complain because me not have no money for pay my bridge and if my bridge and have to do whatever i have to do for make sure so he can take care of him family i have to sit patiently and wait so anytime the court they feel like they need me for being at the court at a specific time i would ask that court to make one of those private government vehicle not none of them mark police that mash up mash up vehicle like bring one on a chris vehicle come pick me up and carry me back home so i can demonstrate when i demonstrate within a court system and at least teach you know i give you know, some little places for really grow because i you grow I can't just continue going like Seboa, I can't continue running amok a society. The time change. Everybody are correct themselves. And no one is above the law. No one is immune. None. I send a letter to the to the resident magistrate, R. M. Edwards, because I can't call her name because them in a public. Them not have no kind of immunity when they in a public. The moment you mess with me, you know, when in a trouble, you know, anyone I want to put on a name and document concerning me, concerning my estate, concerning this sovereign man in his sovereign state capacity, you guys will be in trouble. Can <laughs> I talk thing do it, you know? All of who put them name and document and come in front me and don't demonstrate themselves in a them lawful capacity, adhering adhering to the supreme law of the land and now come with a foreign law you know said so consider that's treason trust me don't play around don't play around when i send that letter to that lady registered mail card jamaica is a different process than foreign them things a little bit slower around here you get me when i forgot a quote that judge don't show up is a di different judge I deal with the case them say it's a more superior resident magistrate her name is S I don't want to bust her name because I'm going to go in front of her to see what she I deal with yet but it's SM with 2D night you know so I have to construct a letter now and send to she and I know so when she get the letter it's a different person it's the game this cat and mouse game is a different person going to come sit down so them I can always call plausible deniability them never get the letter or them never in a court but to it registered someone have to sign for it you know what I mean so I know now I get the information I know now I get the correspondence 
You know what I mean? However, to me no say enough on and I really bright enough. Me still present myself. You know what I mean? As the paramount security interest holder of the registered or unregistered listen, you know. You know. I demonstrate all of this in our courthouse. I demonstrate it when the police pull me over on the road. So you don't have no authority here. Let me get your supervisor. This is why by your own commission and omission you shall be judged. You can't play around. You can't play around, man. You know what I mean? Because honor everybody dumb. And listen, people. People, on enough to be afraid for ask questions. Don't be afraid for stand up for your right, man. You know what I mean? Because the truth is this, you know. Is how you truly live your life, you know. But really, I got count for something, you know. And about you just I live like a mouse, a little mighty Mickey Mouse around here. Is how you conduct yourself, is how you apply yourself, is how you push forward and the good things them, the upright things them, the proper things them where you do, them things they got set in stone in the earth. And the bad man thing. Oh me a bad man and I kill off some man and some man talk about you for a year or two and then you are forgotten. You are forgotten. Got bad things you are doing on earth. But look upon a man like Christ. How much thousand years now? The historical Christ name still reign. You get me? I not talk about the caricature. I talk about the historical. Because the Christ consciousness is a thing, you know. Where they're within all man. But that is a next level. As we go along, we break down these things in a practical way. So we really can't get it. We talk about on a, on a, on a, on a power centers, which, are, which, which is on a chakras, and show now on a can just naturally, naturally stimulate these things. You know, if you do all kind of craziness, you just have to balance and correct yourself. Yeah, man, so see the Jamaica Constitution, yeah? You know what I mean? Yeah, man. Just take it up here. Just go through it. Just look at it. And just take your time. Anyway, you know, me I come up to my one hour mark. Cause you know, me no want to put nothing out there where the people them fall asleep. I just there for say, boy, listen. As we go along, step by step, we're going to disseminate some simple information. You know what I mean? And I like do it this way. I don't really like this scholarly thing where you come and you read something and you go on like say at the same style them go on with in them university at the same style because everybody now too them have google and youtube so them are scholar everybody now so them are study and everybody and and all one question me ask where you can demonstrate what have you demonstrate what have you done yo me hear jonah be I said, boy, Yosef L. Yosef said to him, say, yo, you're going to court? If you're not going to court, I don't want to chat to you, are you? If you can't show me certain documents, I don't want to talk to you. And I'm right, you have to qualify. And I don't talk about some man where I talk about you're going to court and I hip you. I talk about when you're going to that and control that. And have the judge respect that and respect your honor. You know what I mean? And because you're proper and correct and respectful of the court, then in turn, they might give you back that respect. So you, Sefel, I dare you to tell you, say, yes, my king, I have those experiences under my belt now. You know what I mean? So the man, them, when I go into the battlefield and I go into the firing line and I know where a gunshot sound like. You get me? Them don't know where it feel like to be injured, to be wounded, to be hurt. Them don't know nothing about them thing there. Them just comfortable in them living room. With them expensive computer. And all of the equipments what them need. And then them talk a lot of mess like them do something or them know something. Watch me now man, your time I come to you know. Because I don't know I get to walk over the water and I do no nakedness get exposed to. You think it's a joke about I think this? 
a time I come where someone's gonna go through the earth and know say boy if you you not up in you know, and I come perpetrate like you're up in you know, we're gonna expose you if you are say boy you're sovereign in your capacity you better can present a private document outside of these corporate corporate construct them are gonna respect that all when them go on like them they know it and acknowledge it they will respect it but you are say boy you are indian and you are all of these things and you're in a total assimilation with the foreign corporation then them not to laugh at you and when you fuck around them lick off your head clean because you are them subject slave a man like me me i tell you straight up front say a financial ruin Financial ruin, ya. We have to do better. Our public servants, they are our servants. They are our public servants. These government officials. It's an office we carry a lot of integrity. The moment you step into that office, come out of your private house and you step into that office, you're a different person. You're a person where your standard have to be way much higher than the people them where you try to govern. Your standard have to be way much higher. You can't teethy teethy like the people them where you can't read and write. Because if them look upon you as a government official, a thief, then they're not a thief. If them look upon you as a government official in a gang, then what do you think? They're going to farm for them gang too. The people them go can follow what them leaders are do. And when they see that the society is so degraded, you know say boy the leading force, the leading power, the whoever said them a lead, that is only the reflection of them. Cause if you corrupt at the top, then the body I go corrupt. The moment we start cleaning our house, then remember the body are going to clean up. All some man where not like properness and goodness and correctness, them are going to leave. You know, I go have to tell them for go. Them are going to spot where I go on and cut early. You are going to hire some people like me now for come do some work. And our work are when we are serve the people. We not look no big money for that. You don't even have to pay me for serve the people. Just don't make me a work and when me a like a talk or I do some things and me have to come out of my pocket for buy some water. They get me because the moment me I do any kind of work, I deserve to get some pay. So when I have some official talk about them, I give you order and I tell you if you do this and do that. You have to put yourself in a position where when them look, them get all the invoice in the mail. Because them did I give order. I think when I notice with Jamaica, I go into the traffic court and them have nothing on record. Nothing them have on record, them have nothing to record. If me now record my thing privately, nothing now going to be recorded. Hence, I know that no court now go on. Them have invite me in a them jurisdiction, yet I not have a proper charging instrument. I not have no document for can say these people are charged me for this or that. Them totally away so them in a trouble car the moment you mess with a man like me in a this capacity, you know what time it is. You know what time it is. Cause we're gonna demonstrate with intellectual ability and we never got the university up a your way, forget these things. You know what I mean? We never got a university a your way. If you acquire this information, this information is completely private. You we don't even have them information, yeah. For I go a UA, they have, me have to go create a brand new curriculum and carry go a UA. This is when they are going to give me some natural honorary degree. Because they are going to say, wait, I know all of these things and I don't do it this way. That's because I never spoil. I never allow nobody to tell me how to think. Critical thinking has always been in our, in our system. So as much as I respect the man them where so them are educate themselves, I respect the youth them where I try to learn some things, but I also know say so all institution where so them are educational institution is foreign to us. The curriculum where them are teach is a servile curriculum teach you how to become a proper slave. 
when you get the seven liberal arts and sciences, if you study medicine, you study all aspects of medicine, you reach a level where you create your own instrument where you want to use in your field and you got to do them things that naturally with the quadrivium and the trivium method of learning that's the seven liberal arts and sciences not this look a new age seven liberals garbage with them have we are talking about we are connect music with arithmetic you get me astronomy and calculus all of these things connected everything is connected there's no separation So we have to bring them thing here forward. We have to publish with knowledge, make people know, say, brethren, we know about the correct sentence structure, communication, parsing, syntax, grammar. We know that the government right now only can communicate in an adverb, verb, fiction format. You know what I mean? We know these things. So when a man says study by looking at some tapes, that's one thing. Come make me sit down and reason like how oh, you hear me a reason now. That's when I gonna know where you know and if you're truly educated. I'll ask this question, I ask it to a lot of so-called educators. From where does that term education derive? From where does that phrase derive? Pedagogy. That's the word. Look it up etymologically. Pedagogy. And when you look up pedagogy, it's gonna say education comma attendance on boys just just meditate upon that this is where education I come from Cause I can't tell you this in my ancestors time there is no time at all the foreign education was any good for us that was a way of conditioning us this is why I say we have this automated society now where everybody lives in complete fear. Complete fear. A man quicker for arm the brother where he must see every day in our community. The man they will chop up them man, they chop off them head, do everything to them and they must see him every day in our community. Or the strength they have. Getting big gun and shoot down four or five people in our community. Or even go in our neighboring community. And think so that is enemy. Brethren. Them think they are insanity. Them think they are insanity. Look around your brethren. The people them where you are hurt are the same people. They are the same condition like you. We are all being oppressed. We are all being oppressed. We are all frustrated. And not everybody I got to talk about them are going to rob, shoot and kill because they are frustrated. What's wrong with you people? How nobody not talk to you? Oh, nobody not tell you, say, watch your man. Go easy, man. Go easy. Whole heap of weed there where a water we drink and belch because we don't have no food for eat. And we don't even complain so we don't have no food for eat. We just drink some pipe water. We can't even get no bottle filter water. A good thing a yard with it. We them start spoil up the water completely because it's already spoiled. But a water we drink and belch and we don't watch no face and people don't know these things. So how oh, not talk about nothing not go on so no one go rob and kill and create me I'm in a society and make the place bad. Make the place worse fit. Brethren, correct on yourself. Me I talk about some little dunce boy where love take up gun. The gun won't have more expensive than the old board house wanna live in a. So you see the man where I bring the expensive gun there come go now. Just talk to him softly and say, my brother, keep the gun here you now and bring a laptop come give me. Because if all of we have laptop in our community opposed to gun number one, lesser we are going to on the street for getting a problem. We are going in our house and study. Number two, because we are studying, we are going to get information where now we can conduct ourselves properly. Number three, the state itself. I forgot to comment we. Because them don't have no problem from we in the ghetto or in the lower class. A society where people look upon as nothing at all. Them don't have no problem from we. But we are fair correct ourselves. And we are fair do that from the top. We are tired of them little Mickey Mouse politicians here when I come from nowhere. Some of them Mickey Mouse politicians here. Do them genealogy. You find so them come out of some orphan age home. Now for them old politicians yeah. You see all them sons come in a politics and do the same old nastiness what them did I do. 
brethren, correct on yourself. On you have an honorable office, but on you are acting dishonorable. On you supposed to move with clean hands, but on you have function with unclean hands. I stop that. Enough of it. Correct yourself. Ignorance of the law is no excuse. Correct yourselves. Govern yourselves accordingly. Anyway, may I wind it up right now in us so we give thanks and praise as usual. We honor to the public out there because we're on a public platform. So we honor the public. We honor the subscribers. May I get new subscribers every day? <coughs> Thanks to my brethren, Dark Man X. Because I know him I promote the thing. However, Dark Man X, you know how the thing stay. Our thing simple. Our thing simple. <coughs> and we don't know your energy is a different kind of energy. So we give thanks. But our thing simple, my brother. Respect and honor. Subscribers. Boy, may I tell you. When me see subscribers are join on to the thing, I say give thanks. Because at least other people are get the information and please don't be afraid for share this platform because when i come here i come rare 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 with other platform at time i come i go and link with all kind of ones and all kind of ones i got here we sit down together and we are going to reason and we are going to run joke and we are going to laugh and there's some other life we have the thing we have all some Moors, we have all some Pan-African, we have all some Egyptian, we have all some Ethiopian, we have all a big group. And every man just a hold them out and every man just a bring what them a bring and with us a vibe as a people, as a mix people. Because we are going to have the Chinese man and we are going to have the Japanese and we are going to have the... Watch me now, man. You see the ones that the untidy spirit. We don't want them, you know. Them not going to come mingle with us, you know. Them are going to in their own space. So I ain't not worry about that. I have focused on the ones them where I say correct living. You know what I mean? Lawful living. And them ones that we are focused on. The ones them we are vibrate on this frequency. The one them we are demonstrate. The right, the correct kind of energy. My salute goes out. To the divinity in all man and woman. Because when I say man, you know what I mean? I mean both man and woman. So just bear with me. But I salute the divinity in all of the ones them. Complete honor with respect to that inner man. To that Buddha within you. To that God within you. To that higher one within you. Respect and honor. Nam me yo ho renge kyo. Nam me yo ho renge kyo. Nam me yo ho renge kyo. Anna.